up beautiful people for those who don't know me my name is Despina and here at crystals within today we'll talk about spirituality and racism if you haven't followed yet at crystals within here on YouTube I'll say go ahead and follow crystals within also like this video because it does bring good energy and make sure you hit that bell button so every time I post about crystal spirituality meditation chakras all that good stuff you receive notifications so you don't miss a thing so Let's go ahead and talk on our subject. First of all, this video is dedicated to Black Lives Matter movement. This is all for you. So, chakras have been given to each one of us, each one for a specific reason. And here on this earth, we have this earthly experience thinking that there's good and bad things on earth. We have this sense that um, things are good or bad, certain energies are good or bad. So we have this sense because we are here on earth. So because of this reason, we tend to overactivate or underactivate certain chakras. And this doesn't have to be a permanent thing if we realize that there is a problem with a specific chakra. Only when we realize that there's a problem, we can fix the problem. So our third eye specifically was given to us so we can see. This is the I see chakra because not only we need to see the within world we carry, but also we have to see the outside world, the universe, the earthly experience and see what is happening in our everyday life. For this reason, it's important we open our eyes and realize that racism exists. This is a reality what, that if we deny, we will not be able to fix. We will not be able to change, to make a change on this very subject. Positive and negative energies were created on earth. And that's why racism actually exists. But what is happening right now, this positive and energy that created everything in the universe is now out of balance. We are in the third density, which is the solar plexus chakra. And the solar plexus chakra, when it's overactivated, something that is happening right now, it brings out an obsessive, critical um, stubborn energy that uses its ego to gain power and control when this chakra is balanced we see a willpower to do good for the world but in this case is overactive and that's why the great awakening is happening that's why the spiritual awakening is starting to happen because this energy needs to change so now we're moving from the third density to the fourth density, which is the heart chakra. And heart chakra is all about love, compassion, understanding, being there for each other, serenity, calmness, um, just fairness, compassion in the world. That's why for those that they're not moving along with this change, they're not going with this change, they will have a very hard time being here on earth. This new energy is coming whether we like it or not, and that's why we see so many changes. Next to the third eye, which is the um, chakra of I see, we see two chakras. We see the throat chakra and then we see the crown chakra. We use our throat chakra so we can speak up, but not just speak up, speak up from the name of the divine, speak up, with what we learn from our third eye chakra. Our third eye chakra is a chakra that needs to learn everything, learn all the perspectives that are out there. So in this case, through this movement, it's important we learn about all perspectives that are out there. And then we take our throat chakra and we speak up to what's right, what represents the divine. Then next to the third eye, we see the crown chakra, which is 
the chakra of the universe, the chakra of feeling the universe, understanding the universe is the chakra of I understand. So we take what we learn from our third eye and we apply it right now to our crown chakra by understanding that we're all connected. We're all one. We are all one um, energy, one race, the human race. That's why this movement is happening because we need to move through this energy. It is so important we study these energies and understand them because whether we like it or not, change is coming. Change has to come. We overabuse this third density energy. So now we have to move to the next one and things are shifting very rapidly. This year 2020 is a critical year that we have to learn, we have to realize that we have to change and move with the movement of the universe. The universe is so powerful and we have no choice. We have to go with it because we are one with it. We are one with the universe. We all come together from one source. So the divine is one source. So through this movement, please, I ask you, speak your truth coming from the divine. See, see everything, all perspectives that are connected to the divine, that are connected to fairness, are connected to unity, are connected to peace, to love. And then use that for your crown chakra to understand the power that we humans have when we are connected to that divine. So for this reason, I've done a meditation on Instagram before that it was such a success that I wanted to bring a meditation on this matter on this platform as well. So if you wish to meditate for world peace, please stay tuned to watch the following meditation. So if you wish to meditate, let's go ahead and sit in a comfortable position. So you can either sit for this meditation or you can sit um, by being in a meditative pose. I would recommend you laying down because laying down, our brain associates that with going to sleep. So we wanna make sure we are staying awake for this specific meditation. So for this meditation, we'll realize the, ha the love that exists within us, that we have within us, and then we'll take this love and send it outside to the world. So let's make sure our spine is straight. I'm wearing my rose quartz today to make sure we receive the love of the universe. And open your chest, telling the universe, I am ready. I am ready to receive this love and um, extend this love that I will receive to the world, to the hearts of the universe. So let's go ahead and close our eyes. Place your hands at a comfortable place. And we're not gonna meditate yet. We're just gonna take a moment to just settle our bodies, settle our legs, settle your shoulders, drop them down, relax your head. And we are gonna enter the state of meditation. So first to understand that, ex that love that exists within us, let's take a moment to focus on our breath. Let's take a moment to focus on the breath that is coming in and is going out of our body. And notice that the universe is the one that is providing you this breath. You notice that the universe is giving you life because it loves you through this breath. So allow this life, allow this love, allow this pure energy to enter your body through the breath. Allow this breath to speak to you and allow it to remind you who you truly are in your heart. So take a deep breath in 
and exhale take a deep breath in and exhale take a deep breath in and exhale and with every breath allow yourself to remember how loved you are by the universe allow yourself to remember who you truly are that you're one with this universe you're one with the creation of the universe you're one with everything that the universe has created everything around you and exhale any burdens exhale any pain any limited beliefs and allow the universe to grab those things that no longer serve you breathe in the love exhale the burdens breathe in the love and exhale the burdens and as you're remembering the love that exists within you take a moment to listen to your heartbeat take a moment to connect to the heartbeat and know that it's because of this breath is because of the love for the universe that this organ is beating for you and as you're recognizing this organ this heart take a moment to also realize that this is the only organ in your body that you can feel right now because it is there to remind you the love that you have within it is there to remind you the love of the universe and if the universe is giving you that love imagine the half that you have within you at every breath you take so take this breath to also relax you let you know that you're safe throughout this meditation so relax your head relax your eyes your chin let your shoulders fall allow the gravity to grab them grab your legs allow the gravity to grab your legs and as you're going through the meditation allow yourself to let go and feel the love you have within feel it getting stronger in your heart with every breath you take and through this breath say to yourself may I be kind to myself breathe it all in may I be kind to myself and allow the energy of these words to pass through your body through your heart may I be kind to myself breathe it in may I be kind to myself and see this kindness expanding from your heart throughout your body see it entering the organs inside your body your brain 
your lungs, your stomach, your legs, your hands. May I be kind to myself, breathe it in. May I be kind to myself. And as you're breathing it in, exhale to all the hearts that exist in this world, to all the living creatures. Exhale by saying, May I be kind to others. Exhale, may I be kind to others. And allow yourself to exchange this energy through your breath. May I be kind to myself. Let yourself be kind to yourself. Breathe out, may I be kind to others. May I be kind to myself. May I be kind to others. May I be kind to myself. May I be kind to others. May I be kind to myself. May I be kind to others. Allow this energy to flow knowing that you have the power within you to do that. Trust this energy that you feel in your heart. Trust the universe that this energy will move to the hearts of others. Recognize the power you have within you as you're exchanging this energy through your breath. May I be kind to myself. May I be kind to others. May I be kind to myself. May I be kind to others. And take a moment to witness the beauty of this exchange. Take a moment to witness the love, the peacefulness, the joy you feel by exchanging this energy. Thank the universe for providing you with this breath, with this energy. And also thank yourself for taking the time to send loving energies to the universe. One last time, let's breathe it all in. May I be kind to myself. Feel the love that exists within you. And exhale, may I be kind to others. See the love coming out of your body, entering the hearts of the people around you. May I be kind to myself. May I be kind to others. May I be kind to myself. May I be kind to others. And as we're coming to the end of this meditation, Start becoming aware of your body, of the space around you, of the energies around you. But also remember the love you have within and the power you have within to exchange this energy at any point in time. Start strengthening your spine Open your chest. And whenever you're ready, just open your eyes.
Thank you all for taking part of this important meditation. I appreciate you all for watching this because this is the time that we need to make a change. This is the time that is happening. And remember, losing hope is like losing power. So remember to never lose hope and know that the universe has your back. The universe is fair, is loving. Thank you all. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.